David and Barbara Jean, welcome to our gondola sessions. Uh, Thank you. It's great having you here on this uh, chilly but brilliant New Year's Day. So, uh, Barbara Jean, you've been, or had been living up on the North Shore here for seven years now. Mm -hmm. uh, played Papa Charlie's dozens of times. Mm -hmm. Tell me what you like about that room. Uh, well, it's always a good time. People are here. Skiing, they're on vacation, uh, usually pretty happy to be around. So it's, it's very warm as far as the environment goes, and uh, sound guy Jerry always does a really good job. So it's just a, a fun room with people who are relaxed and having a good time. I, I love it that the audience is always on vacation, and, uh -huh. and it just brings them to another level. Works out well. Yeah, that's great. <laughs> and David, your band, The Pines, just uh, recently played here for the first time in December. Yes. And that was one, you know, I, I booked it because I love the music, but it's a bit risky for a Saturday night for us. Uh, I see you guys as kind of concert listening music, and our Saturday night crowd is a bit of a party, woohoo, let's rock and roll. Yeah. And the set list you guys put together was like a big rock show. Well... I mean, it's not a stretch. A lot of people, you know, they think you, they just have to stick to their guns and you don't want to change what you do. But I think professionals, people that want to connect with people, play to a room. So knowing what kind of room it was, I've been up here before. I've seen shows here and enjoyed them. And so we just uh, we brought our, our dear drummer friend, JT Bates. And uh, we like to be able to put on a show in a lot of different environments. And <clears throat> I think uh, it, works, it works well being flexible like them. Yeah, I mean, it exceeded my expectations for it. I was expecting good music, but the way it worked in the room and uh, just that full sound that, that came out was, it was an awesome night. So yeah, thank you so much. you did. And the set list too, you know, a lot of blues. I think blues music helps. Uh, anything with a groove can really change the dynamic of, of to a big room and a small room. It, it translates very well. So Yeah, worked through well. So what are the Pines up to now for the rest of winter here? Uh, well, we're going to start writing a new record because uh, we got to get to work on it. And uh, we're going to go out and do a few shows with Emily Lou Harris it's in January and then uh, to the East Coast a couple times. But mostly it's time to sort of circle the wagons and come up with some new songs. Nice, nice. And Barbara Jean, you've moved down to the Twin Cities now and uh, off on your own. Uh, what, what's, what's coming up for you? Well, I'm um, playing with lots of different folks in the cities, which has been really fun. I had a CD release uh, party in kind of mid-November with a full band, and so I've just been 
really enjoying the opportunities, uh, different venues, got to play at the Dakota, hope to do that again soon, and um, that's kind of what's on the horizon. Well, we're excited as heck for you up here. I mean, uh, to have spent the time listening to you here and, uh, and then see you go, go out there like that is awesome. But, uh, but the big question is, do you miss us? Yes, I totally do. <laughs> it's been a rough adjustment. Life uh, in Cook County, it really gets under your skin, you know? It's so rural and it's epically beautiful uh, and it kind of becomes a part of you and being a block off Cedar and Lake Street just isn't quite the same as having wolves howl in my backyard. Yeah. You know? Well, hopefully we're still with you while you're out there, so. Definitely. Great. Thank you very much, guys. Yeah, yeah. thanks for having us, Jim. Thank you.